Hey, that person. How's the grind going? If you are grinding. I can understand if you are taking a break. Sorry, Yosef, you're not first. Haha. Uh -huh. Alright. Let's continue this hell. Taking a break. Smart move. <clears throat> Still grinding bones? Yeah. <laughs> Sounds about right. Working at this time so you can buy more stars. Sounds a bit right, Ivan. Sounds about right. Hey, Slushy, what's up? Haitaka! What is there to grind? Bones! Great place to grind for bones. Dottle Bob, hey! It's been a while. How have you been? Oh, yes, experience. Perfect spot, right? This uh, hunting quest. I hunt them bones. God damn it. How am I enjoying my empowered waifu? It's beautiful. She's amazing. Have yet to test her out in real battle, but remove all debuffs? Shit. That's like the best thing ever. Fair enough, haven't gotten a bone servant in a long time. Really? <laughs> I feel like that's every other servant. I don't think there's like, what, 150 servants right now? I feel like a good 40% need bones, like skills or something. All right, Yusef, thanks for stopping by. Good luck with your grind. How many of you guys pulled for Ishtar? No, better question, how many of you didn't get Ishtar? You know, make myself feel a bit better. You know, what's funny, when I saw that skeleton's weapon the first time, I thought that was Aya. <laughs> I was like, oh shit, he has Aya? Just a quick glance at it. And it's, oh wait, never mind, it's, a, it's an actual sword. Everyone gets Ishtar, god damn it. I'm jealous. Julian! Well, congrats on your Ishtar. Got her last night, huh? Nice. Is there going to be a discount on skill up costs? Skill up cost? No, no such thing.
Saving for Musashi. Good choice. Great choice. Don't need Isha when you have best asshole? Yes, Gilgamesh. But still, Ishtar is, uh... No, they're both cocky. <laughs> I was about to say, she's a bit more... Well, I mean, she's waifu, right? She, she has more charm. How many bones do I need right now? I don't know. I think... 60, I believe. I think Kualtar needs... 30 bones per, um... Skill. I believe. Could be wrong, but eh. What are you gonna do? Saving for homes! Nice. Saving all the way for Asagami. <laughs> Two years from now, that's dedication. That's hardcore dedication. Deadbeats, hey. What's up? Not gonna grind for bones. Just because you have 140 doesn't mean anything. One day you'll regret it. You'll be like, shit. I should have grinded on that quest for bones. Now I have zip. The life of every master in this game. Should you save for Abby or Hokusai? I go for Hokusai. You say Watching my videos for a year. Wow, that dedication. Nope. Thank you, Deadbeat, for sticking by me this whole time. You're awesome. Power Mag is just win for fangs, huh? <laughs> Way too many void dust. Yeah, same here. What is that? I think they switched the login bonus, right? We're getting more void. <laughs> the best one is QP. Yeah, I know. I heard that a lot of time. I don't need it. I have millions. Listen. Just one server would take up. I, I forgot how much million. Tw you need 20 million for each. To max out each skill. So that's 60 million. And I forgot the rest. 10 million from. I think it's 10 million from 8 to 9. So it's another 30 million. So I'm assuming about 150 million for a five-star servant. Quite insane. Abby is better than Hokusai. <laughs> uh, you're drunk. Who's in K's Discord? I have no idea. I, I'm not even in my own Discord. <laughs> Which is a shame. <laughs> you have Suzuku, Bedivere, and Caesar as your sabers. Ah, oh, and Suzuku is a little underwhelming. Which should you focus on, do you think? Ah, uh, well... Three of them are different roles, right? Bedivere is a single target attacker, right? So he's your main saber damage dealer for boss fights. Suzuku is good for, you know, farming, um, wave clearing, and Caesar is a great support. So it depends on your other servants. Shit. I think I did. Ah, oh, crap! I forgot to use, uh,. I missed a coat. <laughs> Someday you'll suffer QP hell. Yeah, I, I feel like that's everyone. Even my friend said it, like, in the beginning. Oh, he was like... No, I, I, I saw his... Um, we were talking. And we are talking about QP. And it was like, I don't need... I have, I think he said, 100 mil or something. I said, ah, it's more than enough. And a month later, he's like, shit, I need to farm QP. So those who say you uh, don't farm for QP haven't suffered yet. 
but they will. They sure will. Only have yeah, Melt as a five star. Hey, that's a good one, right? Becomes the next event. Who's my favorite Berserker in terms of appearance? Shit. Um, okay, probably had to think about it. In terms of appearance, I would go Lancelot because his armor looks cool. Or his, you no, know, when he's in shadow mode, that's what I call it. So I, I say Lancelot. I would say, uh, Ku Alter, I don't like all the spikes. <laughs> all the spikes is a bit uh, too much. Hassan of the Cursed Arm is better than Ku? You take that back. No one disrespects Doggo like that. Is Atalanta better than Emiya? <laughs> What's less she said? With uh, Scotty, yes. Since she's quick. But, I mean, on by themselves, Emiya is, uh, after strengthening quests, is a lot better. Gotta go, gotta go farm. Oh, <laughs> all right. Take care, uh, Hydra. Take care. Imperial, finally catch your stream. Hey, welcome to my stream. I hope I can entertain you with my... I mean, wait, I'm just farming. What? How much entertainment can there be? Farming, gotta do some farming. Lots of people. Those bones, I'm telling you. Those bones are insane to farm. Especially with my horrible luck in Fuyuki. Hate that place. Can't farm anymore because you're out of apples. Damn. Just my soothing voice is enough. Oh, I appreciate that. You got Jolter, Waver, and Lancer Arturia in JP with only 90 cords. Damn, that's like a five star per 10 shot. That's like beyond EX luck. <laughs> 150 quarts got spooked. I, I got spooked by Emiya as well. God damn it. It was a golden archer card. And that bastard, it was like NP6 as well. I hated him. Go, Gilgamesh! Use tackle. I'm just joking. Oh, speaking of Pokemon, anyone saw Detective Pikachu? It's okay to admit it. Hell, I admit I watched it. Didn't really like it, but brought back a lot of memories. Although, I have to admit, I stopped for Pokemon, right? I stopped on, um... With Generation 2, so I was like, 
so many Pokemon I don't even recognize. I just re recognize like the Charmanders and Bulbasaurs and Gen 1. Don't watch Game of Thrones, so what's your opinion of the last episode? Holy crap. Alright, full spoilers. I got a rant on this shit. What? <laughs> I mean, I can understand if they want to turn Danny evil, but like, there was no build up. I mean, there was slight build up. Okay, Jorah died. Her best friend died. You know, she lost her dragon, but still. It's like. What? She's killing innocents. That just came out of nowhere. You know, like, it would make sense if she were to fly over to Cersei and burn her, you know, or destroy her palace. That, I, I, honestly, I, I thought that was she, that's what, what she's going to do when she started flying, but god damn it, they ruined the show. Freaking ruined the show. I was already pissed off. I mean, yeah, I was already pissed off with the Night King. Night King was already bad. Not because Arya killed him, I'm okay with that. You know, it just came out of nowhere. I always thought Jon would be the one to kill him, but I mean, sure, I'll accept it. But it was just like, <laughs> that's it? Biggest threat in the world? That's it? And then the whole Cersei fight was stupid too. It was not even a fight, it was a slaughter. Right, I thought there was an actual build up to the fight. Like, oh, it's gonna be a hard battle, no. I mean, I'm sure most of you who watch Game of Thrones you know, there's lots of YouTubers making videos about complaining. I'm sure I don't need to uh, be a uh, dead horse with it. If she was losing the battle, her going crazy would make more sense. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like maybe you know if. She she was losing, you know, then she's like, okay, you know, I won't understand, but it's just like she slaughtered everyone. And you know what? I'm just burned innocence. But whatever. One more episode. Let's hope the prequels or spin-offs will uh, be better. Maybe that that will delve more into... Nah, I can't really say about the Night King, because that's this season's, or this series. Secondary antagonist. <laughs> I really want to punch d, &D. Now the only thing that it won't redeem the show, but I just want to see Drogon burn John and him just walk away like fire won't hurt him. You know, he's half Targaryen. And then, <gasps> everyone's shocked. He survived. You know, something like that. Won't redeem the show, but it'll be kind of cool to see. You know, he survives uh, Drogon's fire. Because, you know, Danny's crazy now. Why not kill her ne uh, nephew? Orion, please come home. Oh, wow. It's, most people are hoping for our Ishtar or other archers. But Orion? Well, good luck. I hope you get him. Hair for the anti what's up? Oh, that's hilarious. Well, fate and their character artwork. Closest thing, right? Closest thing you will have. Episode 2 wasn't written by DD and it was the best. Oh yes, episode 2 of Game of Thrones. It was that was the best. You know, it was a great setup for a huge battle. Like, the character moments was good. Character moments was great. But then... <laughs> oh, shit. Afterwards. Hey, Salamander Saber. How's it going? What's my opinion on Orion? Uh, he's... He's good. I mean, niche, but still a good single target, uh, archer. I wouldn't even say niche. There's a lot of male servants. I mean, hell, I'm using a lot of male servants right now. So, really good. Really good, I have to say. Although, I can't remember. I do believe Orion do um, 
suffer with NP gains, even being arts focus, because they have such low hit counts. Wonderlust, hey, appreciate that. Artoria or Attila? Uh, I'll go with Attila. Or Altera, that's how I always call her. Because she has like a crit roll and overall higher attack. Although she doesn't have NP battery, that's the only thing. <clears throat> what made me get into Fate? Um, I saw the original anime from was it Dean? Didn't really like it. Um, and then actually, I was I was pretty casual with Fate until I started playing FGO, and that's when I became more um, you know, that's when I got into it. So FGO. <laughs> well, other than that, it's. In the past, it was just like, you know, an anime I would watch. Now, I like the character designs, play FGO, and then you know, I like the uh, I like the franchise. Although I have to admit, I didn't read the visual novels. I didn't play like the all the games or any games except for Stella, uh, and haven't watched all the animes yet. Oh, shit, forgot to use her ability. I'm sure it's okay. Is it worth repeating the hunting grounds? Uh, depends if you desperately need a uh, material, but no, I don't think it's worth it. It's worth it if you select a servant or servants, see what materials you need, and just level them up. That's about it. I <laughs> farmed 170 bones? Holy crap! That's a lot. I was 100 persona. Uh, she's okay. Arts focus can create some stars. Not really a good damage dealer, even though she is single target. Uh, it's arts, and her, um,. Command card buffs isn't reliable because it's random. Got done watching Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> hey, I used to watch it. Now I just watch some clips. And I saw that you were streaming. Nice. <laughs> you have all you need, just the QP. Ah, oh, that QP hell. Fafnir, how's it going? Going well, I hope. Curse Arm Hassan's the best. You're drunk. That honor goes to Serenity. Clearly, I'm biased, but still, I stand by it. 161 bones for Tamama. Holy crap. That dedication. That dedication. Unlimited QP works to grind. Yes, yes. I should have took advantage of the half um, QP quest in the past. <laughs> all of us are drunk. Title goes to Gramps. No, I feel like that's cheating. Because we all know Gramps is, you know. He's a badass. One look at his design. You know. 
You can't. If anyone says his design is awful, you're drunk. You're clearly drunk and high. How good is Serenity? <laughs> yeah, she's amazing. Best assassin there is. Hey, Vivace, how's it going? How's the hunting grounds treating you? Why not use Shakespeare or Merlin? I mean, I could three turn. I'm um, not three turn farm. Four turn farm. This is fine. I want to end mainly because I would really want to see uh, or use Ishtar. And three more days till finals, then you're done. Nice. Well, good luck. Hope you pass. Remember, if you think you pass, you most likely fail. And if you think you fail, you most likely pass. Right? Kind of works like FGO's desire sensor. I'm doing good. Doing really good. Just a bit of farming. Spent all my tickets trying to get Ishtar, but, you know, gotcha guys just slapped me in the face. But it's okay. I mean, I got Kiara and Melt. <laughs> I, I, I can't be greedy, right? There comes a, a time where you must be humble with your pulls. Just finish one of your exams, you feel horrible. Good stuff. Good stuff. You'll most likely pass. And if you didn't, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Who am I saving for? Uh, I don't even know. Probably Summer now. I really want the... What is it? The Knight's Banner? Or the Knight's. So I'm going to roll on the Knight's Banner, but probably the second one. Because the second one will have Da Vinci. And I kind of want her. I mean, come on, it's Da Vinci. She's awesome. The view, hey. I'm doing good. How about yourself? Got Ishtar? I don't know if you summon Ishtar or not. I just assume a lot of people are going to roll for her. You want Sherlock? You need him to bully Mor Moriarty? Yes. Those two will be awesome together. AP World History Exam. Damn. Now I know I failed my history exams. <laughs> Is it worth trying to get anger mind you and use them? <laughs> oh man. You make it sound like you have uh, any. You can actually get them. Listen, I spent almost three mil friend points trying to get the bastard. Still didn't come. It's worth using. Oh, he's the right team. He's, he's for fun. Use him for fun. Your team is Nito, Passion, Drake, Robin, and and Suzuki. Who should you use to bounce out your team? Wait, is that the, your gold servants? Or is that the two? Wait, you just count one, two, three, four, five. Or is that just your team that you develop? Because it's not very synergistic. Matthew. Uh, I mean, the site I use is occasionally this game press. If you want to try using their site. 
Who should you use to balance out your team? Uh, who's the support? Passion Lab, Drake, Robin, Enkidu, Suzuku. Most of the servers you list, Matthew, are offensive. The biggest support would be Passion Lab because she could defend your team. But most of them are self sufficient attackers. Now, if you're asking if there's an alternative servant for support, I mean, Anderson. Anderson always work. Hey, Devil May Cry, you miss nothing really. That's good. All your luck was spent on Kiara and Passion Lab. Ishtar won't come. <laughs> like I said earlier, gotta be humble. Can't be greedy. Here's something for Ketz. You need a good rider? Yeah, Ketz is a good one. Great offensive one. I'd recommend her. And she's Story Lot? Is she Story Lot? I'm trying to think now. No, I don't think she is. I could, I could probably just Google it, but you know, I'm lazy. Either or, she's still a good rider. Summon her if you uh, need one. What are you without greed? Exactly. You know, you bring a fair point. How many bones do you have? I actually didn't check. Probably in the 30s, if I remember correctly, and you know, just making an estimate on the drops. She is story locked, okay, so she is. More reason to get her then. Who's the best new rider coming up next year or so? You really need one. I probably need to look at a list. Uh, Achilles. That's one. You know, he has a two hit invincibility. Uh, quick, because now next year is going to be qu the quick meta with Scotty. AoE, and uh, he has a taunt NP um, battery skill. All you need for a good rider. So, Achilles. Although I kind of wish his invincibility was three hits, kind of like Coop, but I can see why that could be a bit broken. What's the next good banner to summon on? The next good banner is whatever your hearts desire. Uh, in all seriousness, in terms of gameplay, I mean, <laughs> there's lots of good ones, like repeats. For example, we should get the Knights. I mean, the Knights is always good. You know, you get a shot at you know, Lancelot. Um, no one cares about Gawain, sadly. Uh, what's his name? Tristan. Mordred's good. I don't know why people don't like her. <laughs> Trying to go for MP2 Ishtar, huh? Oh, yes, I think you said that yesterday. Well, sorry to hear that, but yeah, I mean, you got your first copy relatively easy, so that's something to be grateful for. Shoot 10 is coming, that's all you need. Eh, not my kind of servant. Not my kind of servant. <laughs> I'm on thin ice. Damn, Mag Attack loves Gwen then. It's okay, I mean, Gwen is my favorite Knights of the Round. He truly is. The only 
only uh, rider you need is Ozzy. <laughs> well, maybe you'll get him one day. Maybe GSSR. Could happen. Saving for Summer Nero, but one Summer Mordred and Kyo. Because you did not get them last year. Oh man, you gotta make a decision. I mean, or if you have, oh no, a big fat wallet, then no decisions. Just roll till you get them. <laughs> Should you use your parents' money for MP5 Kyo Lancer? Well, that's wrong in so many levels. Probably you can never. I assume you're asking asking them for money. You're right. I shouldn't uh, assume you were taking your parents' money. I mean, go for it. Why not? Gwain keeps evading you. He's the last one you need to complete your harem. <laughs> nice. 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 Uh, he's top tier husband, though, huh? Can respect that. He's one of my choices. But damn, I wish they updated his attack animation. Doesn't look too good. Rob a bank? <laughs> yeah, and during your um, trial, you're like, why did you rob the bank? You know, in my defense, I needed waifus or his bandos, right? Sell all your anime figures. <laughs> That's one way. Anime figures, they don't lose um, in value, right? Their, their, their value usually goes up. So, you can make a big fat profit. Which reminds me, if anime figures go in price and you can make a lot of money, well, I guess I gotta, gotta go rob Shotgun Shogun. Just gonna be like, hey, Shogun, buddy, it's K Collections! I thought I'd visit you. Uh, hand over all your figures. And your uh, FGO and Epic 7 accounts. I'll steal those too. I'll be like, free giveaway! <laughs> Shogun's FGO accounts. Probably worth like 10k. <laughs> uh, exaggerate, obviously. Maybe not. I mean, he has a lot of MP5s. You know what? I I'm gonna look at Shogun's uh, support later. <laughs> Just to see how insane it is. Because I think Shogun spends more money than Toe Sniper. I think he does. The only th reason why Tom Sniper has a bit more servants is because Shogun didn't start spending a lot until I think probably six months into the game or something. Oh shit! Oh yeah, Shogun's uh, Thanos statue! Oh shit, I gotta steal that. Sell your Yu Gi Oh cards then? <laughs> I should probably look at my very ancient, ancient Yu-Gi-Oh cards I buried in the attic. I'm talking about like, first generation cards. Maybe I could sell them for collectors. Because people like collecting them, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think so, because I know Toe Sniper he doesn't always NP5 his servants right away, but I know Shogun does. Uh, 
Oh yeah, you know what? Never mind. I take that back. Toe Sniper farms like crazy. So spending money on Saint Cores, yeah, Toe Sniper does spend more. I was just thinking about summons in general. Got two shoe boxes full of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh, that's hilarious. I wonder how much like them original blue eyes cost. I think I still have it. Probably uh in shit condition. Cause I had I bought it uh when I was a kid. I think I still have Exodia pieces or something. But again, they're in really bad condition. Man, I just wanna if one thing I regret is that if I go travel back in time, I was smacked by kid self for not leaving my cards. Cause yeah, someone said if they're in good condition in first edition, uh, it'll worth a lot of money. And I had a few original iconic cards, but I didn't leave them. Oh shit, woman! Oh no, this is right. That wasn't was acting. Back in the day, whoever had Exodia was the cool kid. <laughs> nah, strike that. Whoever had three blue eyes, whoever bought like three uh, decks, the Kaiba decks, was the cool kid in the block. Uh, let's see. If I slap as a kid, would I um, would I feel the pain too? Somebody had it, didn't watch Endgame. I'm just joking. Of course, probably. Exodia is a relevant deck in 2019, really? What kind of shop would even buy Yu-Gi-Oh cards these days? I think more so like collectors, like on eBay or Amazon. I'm sure there are people who has uh Nostalgia for those cards. More experience for your Suzuku. Same here. I'm glad. <laughs> Part of the reason why I'm spending apples. But yo. How many of you guys play Vanguard? <laughs> Carfriend Vanguard, that was my game back in the day. I uh, had so much fun. It's like, final turn! Shadow freaking Paladins, that's my clan, yo. That was my clan. What's a Vanguard? That's a another card game, obviously. Vanguard's kind of lame now, is it? I mean, I stopped during the uh. Whoa, what the freak was it? The reverses or reverses or something. Like evil versions of cards or something. I can't remember the whole thing. That's when I stopped. I know there was like a whole G era or something. I never played that. I mean, that's when I just quit. Magic the Gathering. Oh, was it the Black Lotus? Yeah, I think I saw it on eBay. Was it? I forgot how much it was going for. I, I didn't really get into Magic. I know my cousins or and some of my friends did. I bought a deck, a few booster. That's about it. Duel Masters. Uh, never got into that. Because I think it was released during the whole Yu-Gi-Oh hype, so no one played it, really. Haha, <laughs> Uno! Yes! That shit ends friendship. I think, was there, was there like an official ruling now that you can't stack, uh, draw cards? Yo, back then, we played stack. We're like, you draw four, no. Next person draw six, and then you stack it, <laughs> and whoever can't, uh, counter that stack of cards or a stack of plus cards you basically just quit 
No. You know what ends friendship? Exploding kittens. For those who haven't played it, I know it sounds lame, but it's a fun ass game. Haven't played it in years though, but eh. The thumbnail is tragically beautiful. It is, I have to admit. And that's that thumbnail is all Arash is known for, sadly. Mario Party, <laughs> yes, yes. Oh man. Mario Party. And Mario Kart, all the Mario games really. Smash. Smash was a. Uh, although it's a fighting game, that doesn't really end friendship. Unless you get killed in a shitty way. One day, folks, one day we're gonna have. Uh, Ace! Thank you for the subscription. One day we're gonna have a Smash Brothers movie. Just you wait. <laughs> Smash always ends friendship. Uh, if you die a shitty way, because I remember, I think, I'm trying to remember, we played Melee, I think, or Brawl. I, I haven't played Smash in a while, but uh, a box fell on my friend. Mordred, thank you for the uh, subscription. And he was so pissed. <laughs> uh, we're, we had like a tournament, and then losers buy pizza. Winner doesn't have to pay. And he was about to win, and like a random box fell on him. <laughs> I'm grinding for, um, bones. You murdered everyone with snake? <laughs> uh, with his cheap, um, special attack. Smash movie, is that a good idea? Absolutely. <laughs> uh... Yes, just just use Arash. He's meant for one purpose. It's a noble purpose. Why would you deny his fate? How's the Bone Zone uh, treating me? It's actually really good. Well, it's a heavy investment on AP, but better than the stupid drop rates. Need to farm for pieces and monuments, really. Those are always fun. I hate, I freaking hate uh, farming for, excuse me, oh man. Uh, I hate farming for pieces and monuments. It's so bullshit. Every time I needed monuments, I get freaking pieces. But what's crazy is whenever I need pieces, I get monuments. I'm like, what the freak? This game is made out just to piss you off sometimes. Farming efficiency, yes. Can't deny it. He's good for farming. How good are you the ratios for secret gems in these hunting quests? Uh, it's not good. For gems, it's a uh, oh secret. Um, yeah, still not good. <laughs> I think you have better luck with the uh, daily. I think so far two, one or two only dropped. You'll burn Fion in a heartbeat. <laughs> Oh, that reminds me when uh, Musaki from Kade Gurus just burned me on <laughs> uh, on stream too. I burn him. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I gotta farm for Achilles. <laughs> They're preparing whole year in advance. Need Phoenix Feathers! <laughs> yeah, after the bones, I'm probably not gonna farm any experience cards. Or QP. Running low on that as well. Kill Stano. Oh man, everyone hates him. Bought 200 quarts to get Astolfo. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, I mean, if anything, you can get Astolfo for free. This coming fall, so we. It's not bad. Can't wait for Rashmine and Onigashima. Yeah, I can't wait for them as well. I miss the raid battles. I have not maxed out Musashi skills. I still need those damn proofs. I don't think there's any proofs of uh, for as a hunting quest this week, right? If there is, I gotta farm that. You know what? I gotta know how much bones I have. Thirty-eight. Uh, Kuh needs. How much is Kuh needs? Am I going to well for any of the summer two servants? I want to say well, but that. I think I'll spend a good amount of sand quartz. Probably, uh, I'll buy one $80 sand quartz pack. Okay, I need that. And, oh shit, I need that too. 10 freaking mil. Uh, I'm gonna run out of. No, actually, that's not too bad. Want to roll for shoot 10? You're such a newbie that you didn't properly appreciate her. I mean, it's okay. I know most reviews, even myself, said she was okay. But if you love her now, go for her. I wish you the best of luck. Ooh, she's not open. Oh, yeah, she's not open. Yes. When is the next event with gems? Uh, no idea. Probably narrow fast. I think that has a lottery, and that's the best time to get gems. <laughs> I don't remind you of the coup altar, splurge, and fail. Oh, it happens. It happens. Wow, lots of uh, fans of Cool Alter. Again, not really a fan of the spikes. But he is. Oh shit, she needs bones too. Well, good thing uh, I'm farming for it. I didn't realize she needs bones. You like her outfit? Yeah, me too. I like her last uh, Ascension outfit. God damn it. Come on, give me a great or even a super success. I'll take a super. Save me some experience cards. It looks a bit weird to you. Yeah, there you go. Damn. It's the hat. Yeah, I think so too. The hat kind of looks weird for me. You love Suzuku and you didn't get her or Emiya. Well, there's always next time.
Ooh. Oh no, she doesn't change yet. Well, if you really love Suzuku, um, you can get her with your free ticket. Feathers. Uh, let's continue farming, I guess. You got I mean, Ultra Passion and Suzuka. Nice, nice. I still need a passion, but, but eh, I'll get it in the future. Caster Gill, nice. That commitment, I love it. One of the best kings. What's my 10 to 10 servants? Uh, Jolter, Mash, um, someone else. I don't remember. <laughs> I mean, also will be appearing in some future events. Yes, um, let me think. I know. I forgot which one specifically. Damn. I remember looking at it before, but oh well. Ma waiting for Mordred? <laughs> I can tell you're a fan of Mordred. She's awesome. Well, we should be getting the, uh, what is it? The Knights commemoration? Or the stage play? I mean, they'll pro probably rename it, but we'll get the Knights back with Mordred. Okay, you're gonna either do Tristan or Assassin of Nightless City on your ticket. Nice. Go with Tristan. He's awesome. He's always sad, though. <laughs> you don't know who to choose? Moriarty or, um... Sherlock? Ah, that's a tough one. Musashi is when you're well. Okay, well, best of luck. I hope you get her with very little investment. You know, first 10 shot, even a single pull. Yan King, uh, Queen, uh, nah, I can't freaking <laughs> pronounce Chinese names, but, uh, or Japanese, whichever it is. Um, oh, Shinjuku summons. How is he? You know, I never used him. I don't even know his attack animation, nor his, uh, NP attack, how it looks. You wanted him to spook? <laughs> More husbandos, right? Go sell everything you find for sad. Say it as king, according to your history teacher. Okay, I appreciate that. He's not great, but there are so few and far between assassins that you glad you got him. Yeah, I mean, even getting to me having a new servant is always a good thing. Gives you more options, even if they're not the greatest. What the hell is this dude? I don't realize. What this is. Thinking of how deep you'll go in for uh, Abigail, <laughs> but you want to rush. Both banners are so close to each other. I hate it. I freaking hate it.
Abby over a rush. Oh, how dare you! How dare you! Summer 2 this year, lots of servers you really want. <laughs> I mean, uh, that's the issue with this game, right? That's the issue. Oh, Too many servants, a little money, it's a little sync works. I wonder how much uh, St. Cord's Soberoni won best for Abby. I know he's always a huge fan of her. Your data just updated, so you might be on the final bone farm. Uh, probably different time zones. Cause last I checked, I still have what three hours, two hours, one, two, three. Let me double check. Or maybe you're right. This is when they update the quest. Is there a gacha game with more than one percent SSR? Uh, Fire Emblems, <laughs> but I'll tell you this, you're going to have so much 5 stars, it's not even special anymore. Damn it, you're right, uh, that's my last bone form. I thought it was at 12 o'clock though, or midnight, that's when they update. Fire Emblem gets boring really fast. It does. I don't know. It's There's really nothing to hook you into the game. Characters, I mean, they look cool, but... <laughs> literally, so many characters can be built the same way. It's not even special. Does Okita also have nice boobs? I don't know. Google it. And turn off your safe search, and you may find a lot of great images. Just saying. Okay, so the event is uh, midnight, so I can still farm for bones. If Foe stops running, stupid connection. Did I pull Okita Altar? No need to. I bought Okita Altar on eBay. And Enkidu and Vlad for some reason, but eh, it is what it is. Uh, uh, let's continue. One more wouldn't hurt. Show. Oh yeah, I was, I was, I was saying. Let's look at Shogun's. Uh, oops. Let's look at Shogun's um servants. Let's see. NP5 Nito. NP5 Musashi. Oh, not NP5 um Drake or Gil or Raiko. Okay, never mind. I thought MP5 is all his servants. But still, I mean, if I'm Musashi, uh, Jolter, of course. Huh, interesting. Of course, King Hassan. Oh, he used Grail on King Hassan. Respect. That's something I can really respect. <laughs> you wish you had this much money. I mean, in eh, due time, in due time.
grail your king assigned to a hundred. Nice. Nice. You would give all your grails uh, for mash? I think we all would. She would be unkillable. Holy crap. As long as you have a healer. RNG and uh, FGO is kind of cruel. <laughs> Absolutely. It's one of the... I mean, a lot of games have cruel... Uh, Rates. I mean, FGO isn't the only one with 1%. But, I think FGO, you know, one thing that's bad about it is there's no pity system. I feel like there should be like a pity system. What well, MP level is my Suzuku? Oh, it's not Suzuku, Suzuka. Uh, I think two or three. Don't remember. If Joe really should have cheaper quartz. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, a good thing about it is that um, they increase the quartz amount you get for the packs. Hopefully, they do it again in the future. Unlikely, though, but never know. Well, raid ups are basically pity rolls. <laughs> Uh, not exactly. Worst time, worst thing is getting spooked. It's like fuck. It would be nice if they made servants more accessible, like Fire Emblem Heroes. That I do. Well, are you talking about like more free units? That I do agree. Because I, how many welfares do we get a year? Like five or something? Oh, not, not a lot. And they barely introduced a lot of three stars now. I wish they made more two and one stars. Like I really wish they made more two stars. <laughs> I guess boot by me. Hey, two months from now, it'll be your birthday. Nice, nice. I hope you get the servants you want. Like, more welfare servants or even, like I said, even more three stars. Hell, you know. <laughs> I'll take more three stars. Don't introduce, like, three or so oh, freaking... Yeah. Wait, isn't all the heroes in Fire Emblem heroes constantly pop, get power creeps? Yeah, I heard that's an issue. That's the issue with Fire Emblem. That's why I like FGO a lot more. I mean, freaking Spartacus out of every servant, right? Even before um, Jack the Ripper, he gets an animation update. That shows that, you know, the creators are... You know, they don't forget any servants or characters, right? That's what I like about this game. Fire Emblem Heroes gotcha system, despite having a higher percentage of pity system, is even worse than FGO. Well, the issue with Fire Emblem is that your five stars you pull could mean jack shit if they have bad IVs. That's what happened to me. Like, I spent, I spent a few. Well, a few money. I bought some packs. Huh. Or packs. Um, and I got the hero I wanted, but their IV sucks. And I'm like, really? And even then, you no know, power creep. Uh, as someone said it, you know, in, the, in the future, the old units, they don't even matter anymore.
if your address is power creep, yeah. <laughs> and that's the thing. I, I, a lot of people complain. I mean, I, granted, you know, emotions, passions are high when they get salt. Yeah, I understand. But a lot of people, you know, they trash talk FGL. I mean, it's probably not their style then. Because of not getting a lot of, you know, shiny cards or shiny characters, right? But you, most people don't understand is that, you know, which would you rather have, you know? I, I'm not trying to trash talk Fire Emblem Heroes. Obviously, it's not my kind of thing, but uh, I said it multiple times. The issue with Fire Emblem Heroes is that, you know, I, I have a lot of five stars, but I just don't really care. <laughs> oh, wait, this person... Skills, not mass. Like, I have a lot of five stars in Fire Emblem Heroes, but it's like, eh, sure. <laughs> Doesn't you don't feel like that satisfaction of getting it? Shiro's Game Den, thank you for the subscription. In FGL, on the other hand, even getting a four star, you're happy. Well, for me, anyways, I can't say the same thing for all of you, right? But, you know, like, even getting a 4-star rate up and not getting a 5-star, you feel at least satisfied. Hanako Green proves 3-stars are always viable. Yes, Hanako Green. He is forever the legend of FGO. <laughs> He's my hero because he uses coup. If Joe has issues, but tries to make it easier even for uh, E rank luck. Yeah, exactly. No, granted, you know, not being able to get your favorite characters, you know, like for example, Musashi feels like shit. I, I won't deny that. And that would make someone want to quit. I can understand. But. Again, going back to Spartacus example, I mean, even he's, he gets, uh, he, he, he doesn't get forgotten. It's like, wow. They try and make every servant viable. Uh, but since you got Musashi, you don't feel like shit, do you? Uh, <laughs> I actually kind of regret spending too many Saint Courts on her. I mean, it's a lot of money spent, but... Obviously, you don't know about my Dauntless pulls. Two times, uh, if you combine the two banners, I spent more than Musashi. And I didn't get him. Not, no, I didn't even get a single five star. I think I got some duplicate four stars, though. So, I mean, yeah, it is what it is. So, I know that salty feeling. Because though I love Musashi as waifu, Karna and Dantes is my most favorite character in uh, the Fates series. I just like their design. And they're, they're cool. So it hurts. Oh, I think uh, Kishu, he's a subscriber of mine. He always, he always teases me about uh, the Dantes PTSD. There are people who spend 3k on FGO. Yeah, I believe that. <laughs> it's uh, ranked one of the highest spent gacha games. <laughs> so you can just buy Oki to Alter now? <laughs> I mean, as a starter account, yeah, on eBay. I would be careful, you know, if you go to eBay, you can search up, you know, accounts that has it. But just be careful because some can scam you. Did I roll for Ishtar? Not this time. First time I did.
Oh, excuse me. Oh man, my dinner. Uh, Musashi and Merlin almost made you quit back then. You spent almost uh, a total of 1,500 sen quarters, but your friend convinced you to keep it and got MP2 grass in 180. <laughs> Yeah, I'm glad to hear that you stuck around. And there's really no shame in quitting. I mean, I can understand. I felt like quitting, you know, if... Okay, going back to Dante's, it's like, shit. F in hell. Well, we, we feel salty. It's normal. But your story is a great example, you know? Sometimes just stick it through and you'll get lucky with uh, other servants. Uh, since I'm lacking in proofs, you should use a lot of apples in Nero Fest. <laughs> I absolutely will. You need to level my Musashi up. Your Merlin rolls were so awful. We're all, uh, yeah, we're all awful as well. Oh. It happens. <laughs> Best thing is getting five stars while rolling for a CE. Yes, the desire sensor. I love those two. Yo, watch. Like 50 50% 50 of the player base will get uh, Osakabe Hime, and not even want her, because all we want is that Nightingale CE, that Halloween CE. Mmm. If they make a alternate costume for Nightingale, I'm gonna wail for Nightingale. <laughs> it would be funny if a servant used money to attack the enemy. Well, which famous historic, I mean, I'm sure there is, but a hero who's just freaking rich. I'm sure they'll make a funny character out of him. I mean, they made John Dark. Attack people or attack enemies with a whale and dolphins. I'm sure that's a shot at us FGO players <laughs> One of the problems is, is with the gotcha is that you can never max them and break the five-star event CE Yeah, same here. Sometimes I'm stuck at like Three, only three copies, or even sometimes four copies if I invest a lot of sand quartz. And that pisses me off. <laughs> that, what is it? Growing a tree somewhere? <laughs> I wish, right? Nah, I just saved up. Like, to be honest, I rarely uh, play FGO. I only just deplete my uh, AP run. And that's it. So, <laughs> just saved all my apples. JP's fourth anniversary would let us choose free five star, of course, only from story servants. Nah, I don't think so. Because they know any type of five stars in general, it would people will spend money even on bait banners. Example like a waiver, right? A lot of people would choose waiver or let's say a different servant, but. With a four star, I mean, granted, some people want four stars. It's less of a sacrifice in terms of profits. But I could be wrong. I mean, <laughs> could definitely be wrong. I hope they do give you a free five star. I'll take it. Shoot, I won't complain. Did I get dizzy? Nope, I did not get her. Kind of want her though, but no, I'm saving for Luna, cause she is freaking awesome. I'm just waiting for uh, Luna to return in E7. Just waiting. She's gonna come back, don't you worry. Elon Musk has a servant. <laughs> uh, that's true. Yeah, you had to get her through guaranteed, save for a month and a half. Oh, damn. Well, at least, uh, you know, there's a pity system. Is it true that the burning background will be our greatest enemy in Shimoza? I, I actually don't know. Got both Luna and Dizzy, you bastard. Oh, 
Liking what you're seeing in this game, so you'll stick around with it. Eh. Go for it. You want Dizzy, but start E7 way too late. <laughs> well, we're in the same boat, right? Who's Luna and Dizzy? Uh, they are characters from Epic Seven. It's another gotcha game. Every challenge in Shimoza is difficult. Oh, I'm looking forward to that now. That's when uh, Kojiro gets his attack animation, right? Because once he does, I'm going to grail him. This is from Guilty Gear, uh, Guilty Gear, excuse me, damn, I have a speech problem yet. Uh, oh yes, it's a collaboration, I've never played that game, so, <laughs> characters are new to me. <laughs> this is where you old grail your Ozzy, if you had one, damn. Just throw salt, just eating salt yourself. Huh? <laughs> that bad. You already, already growled Kojiro to 92. Damn. That's dedication. Did I like fighting games play it? I used to like fighting games. I was pretty into Street Fighter. Street Fighter 4. Uh, and then 5 came out, so didn't really like it. I just start with the fighting games. Used to play, what is it, Skullgirls, uh, and other games. <laughs> Marvel vs. Capcom. Oh yeah, I used to be a really hardcore uh, with that game. Used to train for hours. Mastering the Zero Lightning Loop, for those who know what that is. Hey, big, uh, what am I saying? Congrats on uh, the Ishtar. With only a 10 shot. Ooh, damn, that's a shitload of bones. Finally got Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. <laughs> Online is dead, yeah. I think even the new one, Infinite, is dead. Not a lot of people play it. But, uh,. Good times, good times. Just spent countless hours just freaking getting better at fighting games. Thirty-eight. Huh. Oh, I guess I killed some time. Oh, I forgot you could click and drag now. You know, sometimes I just forget about these updates. Makes my life a lot easier. Instead of just individually tapping them. Same. Oh, Infinite, but Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom is really good. It was. I loved it. <laughs> Capcom was so bad back then. It's like a slap to the face because I bought the non, like, I'm sure you guys know about Marvel vs. Capcom. They released the original and then Ultimate came out. It's like a freaking $40 DLC. You have, or not even a DLC. Freaking $40, um, separate game you have to buy it's a difference if it were a DLC but it wasn't so it was so stupid they ripped you off
Four minutes to kill. Oof. That Ishtar. You think I should farm embers instead of bones? Well, I need bones for, um... Kualtar. That's my main priority. Suzuka is... Secondary. The Blue Cyclone. What's up? Hope FGO is treating you nicely. Uh, apparently it's because of the earthquake that happened that caused him to make it an entirely new game set DLC. Oh really? I didn't know that. <laughs> Never have enough embers. <laughs> Uh, people will eventually stop pulling for characters they like and start focusing on next power meta. It stop being fun for people. Uh, I think I feel like I'm missing the conversation. Let me look at all the games that. Oh, we're talking about different games compared to FGL. Yeah, I agree. Roll for more mango to kill time. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Although I'm running low. Oh, look at that. I'm running low on friend points. I need more friends. I'm lonely. Alright, Kojiro. Come on, Mango. Angry Mango, where are you? Once I deplete this, this will make 3 mil. time do I have left? With FGO, people still use characters they love no matter what since they there's no PvP in it. Yeah, I completely agree. Uh, one minute. Okay. <laughs> that thumbnail hurts. I know, right? It's iconic, though. <gasps> What's this? A huge lag? Did I get anger mind you? No, I didn't. That's bullshit. Blackbeard. Maybe that's a sign. A sign that I won't get my waifus. Because <laughs> they'll all, all run in fear. There you go. Ooh. Should I use James? Let's stick with Ishtar. <laughs> He'll be so mad if I got him. Why? It's not like... He's worth anything. Although he's possibly the rarest servant in this game. Carla! Hey! What's up? Farm for bond points. Yeah, there's lots of farming to do. Bond points is one of them.
Although I haven't maxed out a lot of. Uh, no, wait. I only have Herc that's maxed out in terms of Bond. Which is sad. But Arashi's getting there. Shows how much Stella I used. You need more friends for a two copy of Anger Mind You? Oh man, someone's getting greedy there. Hey Drex, how's it going? A bit late, but hey. Still, welcome to the stream. Mary and Drake is almost done. Nice, nice. I feel like Herc is everyone's priority list because, you know, his bond CE is so good. What does the Bond CE do? Um, are you asking about Herx or <laughs> in general? Because in general, it, it's all different for each servant. But for Herc, it revives him three times and cannot be removed. So it's like a mini uh, God's hand. Herc looks cool and all. Yeah, he does. Can't wait for his animation update. Like, I'm so sick of his disgusting vanilla attack. On the verge of having cool Lancer nice. Not a fan of Berserkers. <gasps> Mama Raikou would be pissed off. She's crying now. Three layer of guts, yeah, and he has a gut skill, so four lives. Like I said, mini gods hand. Herc, Drake, and Dayan animation update. Oh yes, I forgot Drake does get an animation update. Use X Alter over him. I see. Waifus over uh big gigantic freaky monsters, huh? <laughs> Can you imagine a PvP existing FGO, a team of unkillable coups? I yo, I could see that. I'm like coup alter, proto coup, regular coup, what else? Caster coup. Shit. That takes up four slots of your team. Maybe uh King not King Hassan, a uh Curse Arm Hassan. <laughs> it's just like fuck. What am I gonna do? Just like get slaughtered by coups. <laughs> what do I think about necromancy CE on Herc? I mean, I mean, it's necromancy in general is a godly CE if you're lucky. So it's not just on Herc. Um, there's a servant. I forgot which one that necromancy is uh, fun to use with. I forgot. I'm trying I'm try to think back. Oh, Hijikata. Yo, someone soloed a freaking challenge quest with uh, Necromancy and Hijikata. And especially when it revives him with, what, 500 HP? He's gonna deal a shit ton of damage.
All right, I think that's it. That's enough bones for today or for a while. Oh, end the stream here. Thanks for stopping by, everyone. It's been a pleasure, as always. Uh, good luck on your Ishtar summons and uh, have fun grinding. Don't tear your hair out because it gets tedious. All right, good night, everyone. <laughs>